everybody, it's Carly, and I'm thrilled to be sharing my first card here at Neat and Tangled. So today I have a very quick process video for you of how I put together this Sweet and Silly Valentine's Day card. I'm starting with some white watercolor paper and three colors of Distress Ink that I'm swiping on my craft mat and then painting a background that is very soft and loose and has lots of water and no real rhyme or reason. <laughs> Now I'm heat setting it because I'm impatient and it's going to warp a little bit because I don't have it taped down to a board, but I'm going to fix that later. So after I've heat set, I'm adding a little splatter because I didn't want it to blend in and then I'm going to heat set again from that splatter. And then I'm going to run it through my die cut machine with a stitched rectangle die and that's going to help with that warping that I was talking about. <laughs> now I've got it with my um, Heart Duo stencil. This is a newer product. It's super cute. and. Uh, please forgive the taping <laughs> of the way I put it on my craft mat. I had little bits of purple tape left over and I just went crazy. So I'm just adding more of those same three colors kind of in the same area that I had painted and just kind of deepening it and giving it some texture. And I love this stencil because you can use it in different ways. You can layer it or you can um, flip it over and put it top to bottom and make that funny pattern that I have. So I've set that background aside. Then I need a big heart. So I'm just um, ink blending on some more cardstock on a little scrap and then die cutting that heart. And then I have this cute love you sentiment and I've die cut it three times and I'm going to glue it together to kind of give it some dimension. So this, with my trusty glue pen I'm just getting those layers put together. Two whites and a black. Now once I've got those all glued together and you can see they're kind of dimensional I want to give it a little bit of gloss. Um, so <laughs> this is something you've seen me do if you've seen any of my videos and if you know me you know why I do this it's because I'm kind of a mess with anything that's supposed to be drying so I'm putting it on an acrylic block with a bit of low tack tape and then um, putting the sentiment on that low tack tape and then putting my glossy accents on top so the reason is now I can take that block <laughs> and set it far away from me and let it dry um, because if you know me you know that I almost always mess that up. <laughs> so now everything's dry and I have all my pieces. I have some cute little squirrels from the My Favorite Net set and I just need to kind of arrange my card and put it all together. Uh, while I was arranging I figured out that one of those squirrels didn't quite fit so I changed them out for the other squirrel. <laughs> You'll see in the finished card. So there you have it. I've got my sweet and silly kind of squirrel Valentine's Day card. Thank you so much for watching. You can see more about this card in the description below and on the Neat and Tangled blog. Happy crafting!